Hello guys, welcome back to ServiceNow 911. This is our second video for CMDB. In this video, we are just going to see the overview of CMDB. So let's go to the instance. This is my demo instance. Let me write the name of the CMDB table. CMDB underscore CI dot list. So you see this is a demo instance and that's why you see very less records here. But in reality, it could be in millions. So now you see this is the parent table that is configuration item table. You can create a new CI here by clicking new and you see here the classes. So let me group by classes. As I told you this is a parent table so you see all these classes. So these classes are nothing but the child table of CMDB class that is configuration item class. You can find all type of things here. You can see the servers, you can see applications means hardware and software you can see switches you can see the services right everything you find here here the classes are 35 that is out of box classes but in reality it depends on your organization's complexity the more kind of classes you have the more greater this table could be okay so this is how the cmdb table looks like so let me open one of the record so this is uh, aix server you can see all the details of AIX server here. Let me open it. So this is how the record looks like. So for this AIX server, we have an asset as well. So generally, when you create a new CI, an asset will be created automatically. Here you see all the configuration details. Okay. At the bottom, this is the most important. That is the relationships. So you see this AIX server is related to all these CIs. Okay, you see the type of relationship. It depends on this storage device. It depends on this database. It is used by these services. You see, these all are the services. And it is used by these web servers. If you want to have some pictorial representation, click on this dependency view. You can see it the way you want, like a vertical, horizontal, radial. You can check individual entity like this one, service app. You can see its form, you can see its map, okay? So everything you can drill down. Just hover over these links, you can see the relationship types as well. And if you click here, you will see like uh, some default settings. Like you can change the levels here. Let's say you want to see only two levels. So you see the two levels are there. Two levels means child and parent. If you go for three level then child, parent then parents, parent. In this way you can navigate. You can add some default filters like filter by depth, filter by type. Okay. All the types which are available here can be displayed. You can hide the type which you don't want and you can unhide the one which you want to see. So all these relationships are stored in this table that is cmdb underscore rel underscore ci. This is the ci relationship table. You see the parent, see the child, you see the relationship between them. You can open it. If you want to update the relationship, you can do everything from here. Whatever you update here will be reflected in this related list here. So my friends, this is all about CMDB overview. I hope you like it. In the next video, we will go more in deep. Thank you so much. Subscribe to our channel. Bye bye.